welcome to Tool Time on location from Al's living room. Today we're going to show you how to conserve energy. Now, a good place to start would be replacing all your old insulation. I recommend that you would... Heidi? Yes? Do tell us when the camera's rolling, won't you? Okay. <laughs> I am Tim, the landlord, Taylor. Of course, you all know my tenant, Al Borland. Now, in winter, homes consume more energy, which is why I like double-glazed windows. And double-glazed donuts. <laughs> now, along with replacing these windows, we've just come from the basement, where we put in new furnace filters. That's right. For maximum efficiency, I recommend you replace the filters every 30 days. Al's on a 30-day cycle. That explains the bloat. Mm. <laughs> all right. Uh, next up... Next up, we're, uh, we're going to look for the greatest source of energy loss in a home, air leaks. Right. And you can usually find a good one underneath the front door. That's right. And to simply fix that, put in a door sweep as a barrier. An easy do-it-yourself fix. Mm -hmm. Let's get to work. All right. Ooh, Al, I see another draft. <sighs> it's a cold one. Welcome back to Tool Time and our continuing effort to make Al's place more energy efficient. Thank you, Heidi. We now give you... The blower, the blower door. door. <laughs> now, a blower door is the most effective way to detect air leaks in your home. It does that by creating a vacuum inside the house, mm -hmm. pulling outside air through any crack or opening you have. That's right. And since you can't see air... Unless you live in Los Angeles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's not pollution. That's a marine layer. <laughs> We're going to use this generator to create smoke so we can then see our leaks. Thank you, Tim. All right, now, have you sealed up the house, all the doors, windows, vents? You bet I have. Then we're ready to see our leaks. All right, but first off, let's make sure that the fireplace flue is shut. A good way to remember that is to close the flue, pull towards you, push away, make fire today. <laughs> My grandfather taught me that. All right, Tim, why don't you go outside and crank up the smoke? <laughs> Can I turn on the blower? All right. It's a great control panel. Look at this bad boy, huh? see smoke, I'll just mark that with my adhesive, and we'll pack and seal the leak. All right, here's one. Pretty common place for it. Smoke will come in under the siding there. Turn off the fan. Tim probably wants me to turn up the fan. No way. Al, I was wrong about the flu. To close the flu is push away from you. And close the flu. <laughs> Boy, that would uh, defeat our purpose, wouldn't it? <laughs> so we'll, uh, we'll just close that up there. Yeah. Seems to be stuck. 